I just ran into the one and only J.M. Mannion, who is always the master of predictions. You see, I make a lot of predictions, but I'm always wrong. You are usually right. Maybe. What are you going to ask me? What division? Figure. Because Latoria Watts is the reigning champion. She won the Arnold this year. But Nicole Wilkins is back and trying to get her title back. Who wins this battle? And let's not forget Candace Lewis either. Uh, I say that it's going to be a three. Let's see. Candace, Nicole, McGillian, Candace Lewis. Okay. It's going to be a four woman race. Give me the four women. Of course, Latoria, Nicole Wilkins, Sydney Gillian, and Candace Lewis. And give me the give me the placings that you think, obviously. Hmm. Well, I think if if Latoria looks like she did at the Arnold, I don't know how anyone's going to beat her. Okay, that, that's honest. Yeah. What does Nicole Wilkins have to do to get her title back? She has to be the phenomenal Nicole Wilkins that she was the last couple of years that she won. And from every indication I've seen, she is buckled down and she's been uh, doing everything. There's the king. How are you? Uh, it, yeah, no, Debbie's in there. Sorry. <laughs> um, do I think she can upset her? Absolutely, I do. I think she can. Uh, but Latoria right now was riding a high like no, nobody else. I agree. Bikini, you're always the bikini king. Bikini's the hardest division to predict, and I, you're the only I'm, person who ever gets it right. I'm predicting a change this year. You are? Wow. Absolutely. That's bold, because Ashley's Absolutely. been dominant. Ashley's been dominant, but I'm predicting that there is going to be a change. And who do you think is, is, is sitting in that next couple positions that might vie for that title? Well, obviously, you have Janet. Right, like. You've got India. Paulino. You've got uh, Angela Texera. Yes, who okay. we love. Right? And there's Juliana Malacarn. Here's Mike. Here. Can anyone Mike beat her? Right anyone beat Juliana? No. I'm not I'm predicting another win right here. Thank you. Wow. That's, okay. that's easy. That's an easy one. Thank I appreciate you. Appreciate it. Adam Swanson, no chance to beat this girl, huh? Uh, who? <laughs> <laughs> you heard it from J.M. Mannion. He predicts all the women. Let, turn around. Let's, Johnny wants to see the glutes. How do you beat that? that that's sexy don't and it's muscular. Beat, don't beat that, right? <laughs> I don't think so. So, and I'm going with her boyfriend for a classic. I, you know, I was going to ask you that, really? Yes. You're going with a Rosh Rabar? Yes. Where do you think Sadiq Fahadzik will uh, fall? Will you make the top six? Easily. In his debut? Yeah. I, easily, yeah. I, Men's physique. I, I listen. I I think my own opinion, and I'm not. You could say I'm biased. I'm not. I think the classic's going to come down to Sadiq and Naraj. Well, that would be a good that, battle. New York versus New York. Right. I think just from watching their progress pictures and everything, and of course I've been I've always followed Sadiq. Yeah, I think it's good. I think that's going to be your. I think that's going to be your top two. Who's going to win men's physique? Uh, Jeremy again is riding high, but uh, where is he? I just uh, George right Brown. George Brown's good. Brandon Hendrickson, of course. How about Jason Poston? Jason's always, yeah. I think that, uh, and you also have the one that gun guy that nobody ever talks about is Ryan Terry. Ryan Terry, we interviewed him the other day from um, yeah. the UK. Um, it, at this point, with Jeremy, it's the 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 adage of you got to knock the champ out, just like you know the years of Ronnie and everybody else. Anyone beat Oksana in fitness? No. What about men's two twelve? Oh, that's easy. Flex Lewis. And men's, who do you like in men's open? This is probably the most controversial division because it's very close. Phil Heath's been off the last two years. Does he win this year? Dexter's going to push him. Wow. Okay, so you think it could be very close between those two. Yes. And listen, I, I like Sean Roden a lot, too. Absolutely. But have we yet seen the best Sean Roden? I don't think we have yet. If we see the best Sean Roden... You could win it, yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Right. What about Big Rami? Man, I, I, I love Rami. He's phenomenal. I think that he's still, uh, I think he's still working his way up. I don't want to say work in progress because that's, that's wrong, but you understand what I'm saying? I, I don't think we've seen the best of him yet either. Muscle maturity, yeah. Yeah. I don't even muscle maturity. I just think, you know, he's fi I think he's finally stabilized with yeah. everything that he's doing. Yeah. But to knock off Phil, Dexter, Sean, it's going to be tough. Where does Kevin Lavroni fall? Does he make top six? We saw half of them today. Hmm. I know your dad liked it. He was smiling. Yeah. Listen, 
you got to understand, I love Kevin. I've known Kevin forever. I mean, my God, I, we were, I was at Kevin's first MPC contest. And I'm, I'm talking about... Maryland. You know, Maryland, yeah. Same with Vince Taylor. So, you know, that I am biased about. I would love to see Kevin in the top six. Oh, me too. Okay? And, you know, I... I hope that the, the wheels match the upper body, and I think that what he did today with, with Cedric just generated more oh. interest and publicity for the Mr. Olympia than anything else right now. I 100% agree. You heard it from the, the predictor of predictors, J.M. Manning. Let's see if your predictions are correct. I, I like how you kind of slid, we slid past bikini because the girls walked by, but I do think there's going to be a new champion. Court you said that. You said that. I said, I said Janet. I also mentioned Courtney King. Oh, Courtney, you didn't mention. Yeah, I didn't mention Courtney. Uh, and listen. And everybody's kind of forgetting, you know, Stacey Alexander's been third how many years? You know I like her physique the best. That's so, one of, that's my favorite. Uh, I just think that Bikini has always been the most fluid of the but division. But Ashley kind of made it not so much the last couple of years. But she's been a whole year off. What, what mm. Ashley are we going to see? I mean, we've seen her, her little Instagram movie clips, but that doesn't mean, right. I don't know right. what that means. So it's wide open, you're saying? I'm not, saying, I'm not saying it's wide open, but I think that there's definitely going to be a change in the guard. I think of, of anything, that division will be the one that will happen in. We'll see if you're right. You're, you, seem, you tend to be right on, on, on a regular basis. Just We're observing and, and you know, knowing the athletes and being around them, I just have, that's my gut feeling. Right. All right. Thanks, so, Jam. Yeah. Good so, predictions. Um, maybe we'll catch up tomorrow, or no, Saturday. After prejudging, we'll, we'll get your impressions. Yeah, yeah, it'll be interesting for sure.